Hello, welcome to Socks Orchard in Devon. The bluebells on this very steep bank have been at their best this spring. We have 18 or 19 birches of 16, 17 different varieties, including Medwed UEI, The birch bark and the bluebells look wonderful together. Malus transitoria thornhaze tansy, beautiful crab apple. We have many corners, Eddie's White Wonder, Norman Haddon, Miss Satomi. We have many deciduous azaleas. Rhododendron. The aces are coming into beautiful leaf. It's so elegant. The drimis, which has become a very large tree. Betula, Betula albo sinensis, pink champagne from Kenneth Ashburner's garden on Dartmoor. Beautiful, beautiful birch. Katsura for the wonderful burnt sugar smell in the autumn as the leaves turn. Oh, beautiful, rather gaudy, but still lovely. Tree peony. the orchard, several apple trees, another pear tree, an apple called red love which has red flowers, red flesh, red skin, a gauge, a mulberry which I know will probably grow Quite large, but it's fairly slow. Christmas pippin is the espalier tree. It has a very good flavour and lasts well too. This grevillea has been in the flower all through the winter. The cardoon which is taking up a great deal of space on what used to be a vegetable bed, but the birds love the seeds. The dahlias need support. They've grown so huge, especially David Howard. But I can squeeze some vegetables in amongst these lower beds. The alpine troughs. We visited Slack Top Alpine Nursery in Yorkshire, really good alpine nursery. This is a very wet corner of the garden. We think there's a spring underneath it somewhere. But when all the different coloured primulas, candelabra primulas are out and the Darmira, it's quite a picture. Isocarpus lazy lady in red. Beautiful when the light comes through the fully formed leaves. Rhododendron fragrantissimum. I wish I could give you smell o vision. So thank you for accompanying me on my tour around the garden. I'm sorry I can't offer you a cup of tea and a lovely slice of cake but perhaps you'll be able to visit the National Garden Scheme Gardens when this epidemic is over and when we can all enjoy garden visits and raising money for the charities that the National Garden Scheme supports. Thank you and goodbye. Keep safe.